Are you troubled by strange noises in the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or your family actually seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Just pick up the phone and call the professionals. Call the... Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. We're, We're ready, ready to, to believe, believe you. you. Franchises available soon. Call for details. Whoa! Russell! Hey, man! You near the East Wing? Yep. But by the new ghost or exhibit? Yeah, why? There's something headed your way. Wait. I hear something. I'm gonna take a look. Wanna hear something really creepy? I was reading about Shandor, you know, the guy who donated most of the Gozer stuff. He was into the occult. You know, supernatural. 
Uh, well, why don't we talk about it some other time? Any other time. Hey, you can't be in here. Stop! Is your haunting an apparition, poltergeist, phantasm wraith, banshee demon specter, tortured solar? What? No, we do not summon dead family members and catch them so you can ask the combination to the safe. Yeah, well, same to you, pal. Hey, it's the new cadet! Welcome aboard! This might be a little dangerous. Great. Danger is our life. We'll start at 50% capacity. That should keep any burning or tissue damage to a minimum. Hey, if you're gonna burn any tissue, do it to the new kid. You can't use Ray. Our mortgage is in his name. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? No names, Ray. I don't want to get too attached to this kid. You know, just in case. <laughs> you remember what happened to the last guy. He's tuned and ready to go. You may feel a little tingle. Good. We've perfected an extensive and rigorous training regimen that will teach you all your equipment's basic functions. It takes some time to achieve master throw skill, but it's definitely worth the effort. <laughs> Was that us? I don't think so. Ray? Had to be some sort of psi energy pulse. Substantial, a significant collected and centralized necromantic convulsion level seven or more. Agreed, we need EMF measurement checks now. I know the answer, but I'm gonna ask anyway, is a level seven, uh, whatever, bad or very bad? On a scale of one to 10, I would say, let me guess, it's a seven. Let's just say we're about to get real busy. And that is not the fun kind of getting busy, is it, Ray? Look out! Slimer's escaped again! No, wait, come back. Call me Vigo the Despised, or Vigo Let's the move. Unholy. Oh, ah, never mind. Missing an opportunity. Hello, Ghostbusters. Just one there it is. Let it seems get. oddly drawn to the containment grid. He's been fascinated with it ever since you added the viewer to the unit. Okay, easy you... now, Cadet. I'll talk you through this. Use the proton stream to get his attention. And the number where you can... No, not the containment unit. That's some highly okay. sensitive equipment you're disintegrating there, kid. Yeah. Oops, you let one out? That's my fault. I was fine-tuning the interspatial gasket this afternoon. I'll fix it. You two get those ghosts back. Hey, this will work out great since you're already strapped into a pack. It's a perfect opportunity for some training. Taking the right precautions, Slimer's harmless. Uh, more or less. Not sure about the other guy, though. Okay, let's go get him then. 
Oh, and uh, don't sweat the containment unit. It's easy to get excited your first time out with the proton stream. Egon will fix it in no time. First and foremost, before things get out of hand, you want to get to know your proton pack. It can be your best friend out there in the field. Everything you need to know is displayed on the pack itself. Here's where you keep an eye on your current physical condition. The more green that's on the bar, the more damage you can sustain and still stay on your feet. This bar indicates your pack's heat level. When it gets to the top, you'll want to vent the pack and keep it from shorting out and resetting. For the most part, capturing a ghost is pretty straightforward. We break it into three basic steps. Sap them, cap them, and trap them. Spectral entities derive all their strength from an accumulation of PK energy. Blasting them with your proton stream or other offensive equipment helps to dissipate that energy. Dissipating their PK energy also makes them easier to capture. Do it again! See that overlay on the ghost? It indicates the current accumulation of a ghost's PKE. The more you disperse, the weaker it becomes. There it is! Ugh. And I thought Slimer was disgusting. Got it good and winded. Next stage, capital. You can project the capture stream or wrangler manually using this control. Packs moving into the red, can activate it. Get in there and throw a capture stream on that tub of food. Uh -huh. Fantastic, you got it! As soon as your ghost is in your capture stream, the slam meter begins to slowly charge. If you want to accelerate the slam meter charge, you can wrangle or counter wrangle the ghost at the end of the line. Here's how you do that. Watch the ghost. When you make the dash in one direction, you pull the stream quickly in the other. Give it a shot! That's it! Perfecto! Fantastic! You got it! If the ghost still has some serious fight in him, it's almost impossible to drag him into the trap. Back to the top of the up. Pow! Oh, that's right! Now we can move to stage three. Crap him. You're gonna need some place to put that. Just right! Yeah. See the beacon signal coming from the closed trap? That helps the light. 26, you said, kid. Left and right. And there! Oh, yes! One escapee accounted for. Oh, and always remember to retrieve your traps. Did you get them? Ah, uh, we're batting 500. Slimer slipped out. Our cadet bagged his first one, though. A very nasty customer. Oh, and you've got to be very careful about crossing the streams. In a word, don't do it. Seriously. Stings like the Dickens, too. Hey, how come this mump gets all the new stuff? He's our new experimental equipment technician. He gets a cool title, too? It means he gets to carry around a bunch of untested, extremely dangerous hardware that, if not handled correctly, could blow him somewhere into New Jersey. Oh, this knucklehead lugs around our very dangerous prototype hardware that could potentially blow us into New Jersey. Thanks. Keep the title, kid. It'll work hard for you. Scooter. We need to go. Let's roll. Where to, Ray? The Sedgwick Hotel. 
That's the first place that little spud will go. Right. Back to its initial manifestation point. They've got a real good buffet. It is a great one. When Winston returns from the opera, extend an invitation to join us at our table at the Sedgwick. Hey, you. You're up, buddy. Training will be on the job tonight. Try not to destroy too many Manhattan landmarks. That disgusting green blob is up on the 12th floor again, wreaking havoc. I demand a refund right now. Sir, if you check the fine print on our invoice... Invoices. <laughs> right, invoices. You'll see that your warranty on rehaunting expired some time ago. You should have taken the extended service agreement. I'm getting some interesting PKE spikes here. Disturbances don't seem to be exclusive to the 12th floor. I'd like the chance to look around the building a little more. Good. Dig up what you can. Well, that little greenie shouldn't cause us too much trouble. Well, hello. You're perfectly safe now, miss. The Ghostbusters are here. Back off, loser. Never gonna happen. <laughs> that approach rarely works with me. I'll show you why later. All right, Ace. Get ready. Dr. Stance, if you'd do the honors. Proud to, Dr. Venkman. Part of our settlement with the city, proton packs must remain off in heavily populated public areas. And in close quarters. It minimizes the city's liabilities and satisfies the restraining order the maid here had put on us. Where we live in today, you shoot a proton stream of highly charged particles at someone, they get all so happy. It's him! Nice. Now we got another plaintiff. Oh, come on, Ray. I'm the one that gets a face full of slime every time the little green buddy escapes. He doesn't even know me well enough to hate me. Watch it! Contact! Ah, oh, yo! Jeez! Wear him out. Then we capture him. That's what your proton stream is for. You've got him on the run! Come on, let's go! Peter! Nah, I've seen this one already. Know how it ends. You two have fun, though. I'll cover the elevators and escort any ladies safely to their rooms. Yeah, okay. And this signal looks just like your elusive little targeted entity. Your meter will flash and buzz when it detects a potential signal. The paragoggles are linked directly to your active PKE meter. This lets you see otherwise undetectable phenomena while you track it. Ghost trails, object auras, all kinds of cool events. Now when the center bar peaks, you're headed in the right direction. When it's flat, you're following a cold trail. Line the target up with the smallest circle for the best scan. Okay, way to go! Red signifies a hidden ghost. Green indicates an environmental paranormal anomaly. Blue means an active sample. Getting warmer. You're red hot. Careful. Getting a good scan is sort of like taking a good snapshot. Careful.
Whoa! He's definitely been here. An active sample is something you can collect, like a cursed artifact. We get paid extra for everything we scan and collect. Then we roll it back into research and development. The extra funds let us experiment with new equipment and offensive technologies. Which, in turn, you get to wear on your back to test. Remember, you can always review techniques, tutorials, and equipment in your online Ghostbusters field manual. It's all accessible from your PKE meter. Ray! I don't feel good! Peter, come in. You okay? Uh-oh, man down. We've got a man down. Go, go, go! Come on, shake a leg. You can move faster than that.